We're back for another weekend of Air Force Falcon hockey. A little bit of a different type of weekend, though, as the Falcons uh, tonight and tomorrow are playing host to and entertaining the best 18-year-old hockey players in the country. It's the draw, but a takeaway by Team USA, and they will get the clear. Now they turn it over. Short-handed opportunity here, a shot and a goal. Wow, the Falcons gave it away right off front. And after the turnover, that was Dylan Duke, their leading scorer, who center ice crews ahead to Marty. Marty comes in, got a shot, fires away, pad save, made by Homer. Rebound, another shot, put back and in, off the pad of Homer, who thought he'd made the save, but a goal. Will Gavin has the goal. Mirages falls down. The puck's still in the corner, centered out front from there. A shot there by Murchison, a save by LaRock. And the two teams skate off the ice, tied at a goal apiece. We're tied at one. In front of Gibson Homer. Falcons win the draw to the high slot. Maynard the drive, and it hits somebody on the way in. Flip over Homer's head. Goal, Air Force. And Alex Maynard, the senior out of Moorhead, Minnesota, fires one high at the center point that goes in, puts Air Force up 2-1. The rush up here for Air Force does. Pride gets it to Norland. The trailer is Thomas Gaskis, and he buries it, and it's 3-1 Air Force. Boy, oh, what a beautiful play as the Falcons came in on a three-on-two carry it down the right wing side, and Thomas Daskus, the freshman out of Rochester, Michigan, is Air Force's leading scorer. Out to the blue line it goes. A shot there is partially blocked by LaRock. Rebound out front. They try to stuff it in past LaRock, and he makes another big-time save right there from behind the net, dug out and played here by the Nationals. Their rush up is a three-on-three. Three. They got a man with a step on everybody, a shot, and a goal. Falcons just a little slow getting back, and they got burned. Gets it to Zach Mirages. Penalty boxes are empty, we're back to full strength. Rush up by Air Force, and Jacob Marty lights the lamp with a wrister from the hash marks. Marty's the guy that just came out of the penalty box. What a play by Zach Mirages, the defenseman. The second period's gonna end. We had, what, four goals scored in that period? More than that. Four goals in the period, three of them by Air Force. Six and a half to go in the game. In regulation. Rush up here, three on three, shot, score, Nationals. And again, we got a one goal game. Well, again, a team that is fast and skilled like this, they can get behind you quickly. Brennan to Cruz, chipped out of there by Andrew Cruz, but only as far as center ice. Coming right back, one against three, and scoring on the play, that was divine. Oh my gosh, one against three, and he was able to tie this game at four apiece. Up next, we've got a shootout. This is Dylan Duke. He picks it up, moves from left to right. LaRock comes out to meet him. Duke winds up and shoots it right into the chest of Rocky on Gibson Homer. Comes to the circle near side, makes a move, goes forehand, backhand, and then lost the puck on the way in. This is St. Louis. And coming out to meet him is LaRock. Makes a move, goes around, shoots, scores. The net came loose as St. Louis crashed into it, but not before the puck went in. Grime will pick it up at center ice, moving from right to left. Long strides, top of the circle, bottom of the circle. Makes a move, shoots, and no. It looked like he, did he score? Yes. He did score, okay. Here we go the other way, left to right. And this will be Hughes. Hughes makes the move, shoots, scores. Two goals in that shootout for Team USA. Two to one, and well, they came out and celebrated. Luke, when the refs told them stop, and now they're celebrating again. Luke Hughes wins the shootout.